All right, guys, two videos in two days. We'll look out, he might be back. Um, we're, we're going to talk about Tom McDonald. And there's actually, there's going to be two videos today because I also did the radio interview again with the national broadcast, and I'll put that up as well. So there's two videos going up today. Um, Tom McDonald put out a video uh, the other day where he goes through and he advertises his new albums. He's got two new albums dropping on Friday. Now, we'll turn it down a little bit. Now, he's an independent artist. He's built this set himself. Everything here he's done with him and his his partner, right? Nova, Nova Rockefeller. And at the end of the day, this has all been developed by them. This is their set. There's no production company or anything like that. He's built this literally in his backyard or in his house. So, full props for the independent who's doing this stuff, right? This is this is his cinematic ad for these new albums. Now, the reason why we're talking about it is it's been up for about a day or two and it's only got 300,000 views. Now, you're probably sitting here thinking, hmm, what's, what's the deal? So let's go and have a look at uh, some of Tom's... So he has 2.6 million views, subs. His last huge announcement, 400,000. His new album drops Friday, 300,000. Dummies, his music video, 3.3 million views. Tom McDonald, Brainwashed, 6.2 million views. Tom McDonald, Withdrawals, uh, was uh, 3.7 million views. Tom McDonald, Don't Look Down, 5.8 million views. This is a guy that will generally get a million views in a day. But ever since Dummies has come out, some reason he's just not getting the views any more than than what he than he what he used to be. And a lot of us saw this and I, I, I didn't even get notified about this trailer. This trailer here, right? I, I didn't even get notified. I I went through and I only saw it because I was scrolling through his channel and I saw it come up. I was like, oh wait, what's this? Now I've watched Tom's videos religiously. Every time they come out, every Friday, every time there's a cinematic announcement, whatever it may be, I watch his videos, right? So at the end of the day, you can't sit there and make the argument that I didn't see the video. I I, I didn't get notified because, of the because I'm not watching or anything like that, right? That, that's just BS. But for some reason, I didn't get notified about this this video as it went live. Your age. And the thing. I'm for the world for a long time. It's, it's quite a powerful speech, too, mind you. It's, it's a really good speech. It's a really, really good video. Right? And he's basically just sitting there going off on this because he's in this this cinematic trailer he's been charged with incitement and all that because of all these music videos and stuff and he's basically giving them the bird and saying f you we're going to go through and we're going to keep doing what we're doing and you can't stop us right love the message absolutely love it tom if you watch this video for some reason love your message man now at the end of the day what do i think's happened well interesting enough tom actually called in to one of the other YouTube rappers that I actually watch and they actually spoke about this so let's listen to what Tom and this other rapper were saying right is yeah now this is uh, Flozilla Flozilla I think his name is a pretty cool guy. I like him. I like him a lot. He does a uh, yeah. He, he's really interesting reactor. He does rap, all that sort of stuff, right? But him and Tom actually spoke because Tom actually calls him while he's on stream. Um, and they actually talk about this. And then it's content. 
Right, so let's listen to what Tom and and Flozilla talk about. We love watching your reaction Yo, videos. Tom's calling me. Hold up. What's good, bro? You can hear me? Oh, you're watching me? Because <laughs> you're not subbed. You got to sub. Subscribers only. You better subscribe. <laughs> Hold on. Let me put you on, on speaker. Talk. Go ahead. Oh my god, hold on, bro. <laughs> now, um, obviously it starts off with just um, joking around and talking about this whole oh. subscription thing, right? Damn. But Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up, okay, I'm in the wrong place. I gotta search for it, see? It ain't even on my damn screen. So actually, you're right. That shit got home. On the fucking, on that oh, hold up. Fucking with me today? Here he is. This is where I talk about it. <laughs> yeah. No, what's going on? What you mean? I just got home. Oh, hold up. Let me pee right now. Damn. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Okay, I'm in the wrong place. I got to search for it. See? It ain't even on my damn screen. So actually, you're right. And that, that's one thing that, that I noticed too. I didn't see it because it was on the, the home screen. I only saw it because I was going through his YouTube channel. That shit would usually be on my... I wanted right to watch Dummies screen. again. Hold up. 102k? Bro, I get that in a fucking... I know. Minute. So you think they like shadow... As, as he said, 102k, he gets that in like 10 minutes. But for some reason, this video, uh, I think this is about an hour or so later, is struggling to get traction. Banning your shit? No, honestly, that's a, I first thought that that's probably what was going on. But then fucking, I called my homie who has a rep at YouTube. And he was like, yo, like, Tom's freaking out. Like, what the fuck's going on here? And YouTube was like, oh, there's a problem with the notifications from his channel like it's happening to a color that was happening people. to me too that happened Bro, to me the other I, day i just went to fucking machine gun kelly's he just dropped a video like 30 minutes ago so machine how many gun views kelly he got has fucking, he has 8 million subscribers yep in, in, in half about an hour he got 6 thousand views in half an hour are you s so at the end of the day i don't i disagree with tom on here I don't think this is YouTube just having a general problem. I think this is YouTube frigging around with the algorithm. And I think at the end of the day, I think they are burying people that are non-mainstream musicians. This is something that we've seen in the political sphere. We've seen them go through and, and, and suppress content like me, for example. Before I had 100, 100 subscribers on this channel, I used to get over 1,000 views. Now with 2,000 plus subscribers, I'm lucky to get 30. People keep saying they don't see my videos. They don't get notified. They don't come up on the home screen. I'm not the only one that's suffering from this. Other people in the political sphere have also been suffering from it. They banned Copper Top the other day, who, by the way, is the internet's favorite locale. But regardless, they banned him the other day with no warning, no warnings, no strikes, nothing. Just banned him flat out. Now, at the end of the day, I disagree with Tom on this. And Tom, if you do watch this, what I think this is, is I think you're too popular. I think that your videos are starting to get noticed by the algorithm. And at the end of the day, I think what's happening is, is that the shadow banning is starting to affect your channel. Unfortunately, I don't know way around this because this is what we've been dealing with for a few years. And I reckon you'll find that Machine Gun Kelly will be in this similar situation because at the end of the day, he's sort of independent-ish as well. You know, so yeah, I think at the end of the day. Serious? Yeah. 6,000? Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, they now fucking with people. Gun. So at first I was like, oh, this is like some fucked up shit that they're trying to do to me. 
but they're just fucking with you. Like people, period. Bigger channels, yeah, and they're like hitting a bunch of people. So I was like, mm. that's what the hell? Like, of course, the, good on the on the Sweden. on the week that you drop Thank the album, you. they're gonna start fucking with your whole your whole shit. Bro, I just like ranted in my fucking like, low key, man. Like, Nova was like crying and shit this morning because like she knows like how much work how I much work is put into this, this. How much energy, like. Bro, I built that set. I was up till fucking 4.30 in the morning. For this video right this here. For this trailer? Day. Yeah. That, yo, I like, thought you rented something. You built that shit too, bro. You're wilding. Yeah. What the bro, hell? I swear. I'm more this week than I ever did when I was a construction worker. It's fucked. Damn, bro. <laughs> like, in your own yeah. house too. That's crazy, bro. That's so wild. Like, all week, from the second I said I was dropping an album... Facebook's like all my fucking posts. I'm getting fucking like notifications all the time. I try to boost the post for 50 bucks. It gets yep. denied. Like Facebook's been fucking with They're me. They're denying steady. you? Yeah. Bro, it's every dummies. Six, every it's single dummies. post is rejected. Every single one is rejected. It's dummies. So then, yeah, so then I was like, I was really upset, but Nova was like, yo, like your biggest platform's YouTube. Yep. You can shoot, you can shoot your fucking trailer. You put it on YouTube. Everybody will know there's gonna be album. Blah blah blah. And I was like, yeah, you're right, you're right. And then they do this. And then today, this fucking happened. So I'm just like, yo, I worked the fucking year of my life for this Friday, and I feel like I'm just getting kicked in the fucking face right now. Damn, bro. That's like. Yeah. Honestly, I. <sighs> yeah. You know, there's people with way bigger problems. I'm not trying to be like, no, oh, no, but, geez, but I'm just like, for an independent pressure. artist who puts all this work in, like, you, you should be able to catch just, like, fucking cruise control for a second, like, for a few minutes after you drop a video. You should be able to get what you, what's going to happen, what usually would happen every time. So you know it's not, it's not, like, it's not the people. It's not you. It's not the people. It's the, it's the platform. Like, <laughs> it, it it's just crazy how, how, how it will favor certain people's shit and not like if you if you are in the industry for real for real like machine gun kelly i feel like he's in the industry but he's like like he's eminem he could diss eminem and shit like that and have all that shit so he could man, things could still happen to him but if you were in the goddamn industry you're this wouldn't be an issue guarantee if you were rubbing shoulders with these people they would have been on the phone with you they would have called you well they would have called my manager if i had one or <laughs> yeah something one or some shit. Oh, fuck. damn bro but, that's terrible, bro. Yeah, it sucks because it's like after I drop a video, I have like, you know, three, four hours where yeah. I don't have to do anything. And now you so have to go push like, it and tell people what's going on. Yeah, that's like my four hours to play video games like once or twice a month. Yep. And now now I'm like, what the fuck do I even do? Like, like bro, like, I'm call, literally I'm all call you could do. He's fucking reacting right now. <laughs> Let people know. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yo, this dude really calling me in the middle of a live? He can't know that I'm live streaming right now. And then I hear my video in the background mad loud, oh, bro. <laughs> yeah, I was going to comment that it's like, you have to subscribe. And I was like, fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a All right. So at the end of the day, that's, that's their thoughts. I disagree with them. I think at the end of the day, I, I think what Tom is getting at, this is a bigger problem that seems to be affecting a lot of creators at the moment. He's probably right about that. But this is what's happening is, is they're, they're going through and they're pushing non... They're, they're pushing the authoritative sources and, and they're burying the non-authoritative sources. We, we see this in the political sphere, right? At the end of the day, we, we have, uh, you know, like independent YouTubers like me, for example, who... Oh, look, this, this is just some guy sitting in his study. I don't have any major backers. I don't have any sponsors. I don't have any major level deals or, or anything like that. This is just me sitting in front of a webcam with a face rig and an OBS running and a, a screen. At the end of the day, people like me get buried because we're not authoritative sources, even though, to be honest, we generally get the news more right than, than anybody else. But... Like, for example, we're talking about the whole leak, uh, Weehan lab thing. It's 12, 18 months before the news started claiming it was actually a possible solution or a possible cause. But at the end of the day, so we, people like me get buried. And this is what I think Tom is seeing with the music industry. I think they've, they've gone through 
and they've done it to the political sphere. They've buried a lot of the, the uh, non-authoritative services when it comes to the political sphere, and now they're moving through the rest of the genres. They're moving through music, movies. You'll probably find a lot of independent creators for movies and machinimas and stuff, which is also going to be me hopefully soon, is just going to be buried. And, and this is what we're seeing. And this is where I have a problem with like people... Like, for example, a few big Twitch streamers have jumped ship and jumped over to YouTube because they're sick of Twitch. And my argument is, okay, I get that you're sick of Twitch, but at the end of the day, you're trading one master for another. You're trading one terrible platform for another. What, what What's going to be different on YouTube than it is on Twitch right now? Because the way YouTube reacts or carries on, I tell you what, I, I, I would much rather put my videos up on Odyssey right now. And, and Tom, if you do see this, Odyssey, mate, I'm suggesting it now. Start building your Odyssey platform. But at the end of the day, like, even after a, like, a day, he's still only got 300,000 views. And this trailer was pretty epic, man. This trailer was amazing. I thought you'd done a really, really good job. What is Machine Gun Kelly? They said he dropped a new album, right? Uh, hundred thousand views. Ouch! That is got to hurt. From six point nine million down to one hundred thousand, or two point three down to one hundred thousand, he's roughly getting between two to six million views, and he's down to a hundred thousand now. Let, let's just double check. You beautiful bastard. Uh, this is interesting. Hilda Franco has not dropped in viewers. His views yesterday, roughly on par than what they were a week ago. Around six to seven hundred thousand, nine hundred thousand. He's dropped a little bit, but yeah, not a lot. Not not as much as some of these other other people. Um, I've always said he was an establishment, um, but that's my view. But at the end of the day, yeah, um, this is this is what we got to look forward to. Um, is yeah. Guys, let me know your thoughts are in the comment section below. Obviously, at the end of the day, Tom is dropping the new album on Friday. Um, if you are interested in his stuff, please do go and purchase it. Um, this is not paid for or anything like that. He doesn't even know I'm making this video. Um, but at the end of the day, I'll be buying it. Um, I've already got all these other albums. Um, funny enough, I buy them and don't listen to them because I want to keep them in like pristine condition. Um, they're just literally sitting in my display case. But yeah, guys, apart from that... Um, Everybody, yeah, just keep an eye out on YouTube because it seems like there is some really funky stuff going on with some shadow banning. Um, but yeah, let us know what your thoughts are in that comment section below. Obviously, this video has been helpful. Please smack that like button. There will be another video up shortly after this where, obviously, we talk about the... Uh, we actually talk about the... Um, uh, Australia. Actually, we talk about the... Sunday just Australia, I believe. Um, new Australian law. Oh, the new Australian new Australian uh, cyber security law that's coming in that allows them to control your devices. Um, and it was on national radio. Um, so hopefully that raised a little bit of awareness about that. But I'll also upload that that clip for you. It goes for about 15, 20 minutes. So you got two videos today. Apart from that, guys, have a great night. Enjoy yourself, and I will see you all in the next demonetized video from YouTube. That, that saying is so true no matter what. Have a great day and enjoy.